superstars all under the banner of one stable. A united front that is near unstoppable. The big fight feel a high pressure situation and that is exactly where these three superstars want to be. Three legends, three surefire Hall of Famers, three of the greatest we have ever seen. The animal, the cerebral assassin, and the viper. Evolution has drawn the line in the sand. They have come to fight. To prove that they're all time greats. If you were to assemble an all-star team, a dream team of sports entertainment, it would look exactly like Evolution. These two superstars are set to lock up for their respective teams as this six-man tag gets underway. Six superstars, two teams, and let's face facts. We can see anything happen here. We've seen some amazing... Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. The slam! Bo Dallas is calling for it. I think it's about time to roll the dice, Cole. To bed! This is all but over. Cover here. No, he kicks out. Nicely done. So resourceful. What a stop. Good grief. He has him right where he wants him. Uh-oh, Batista is looking to end it. Powerball! Can he finish the job? We got a cover. No, kick out! That's either sheer genius or complete stupidity, Cole. Batista is in position! Bomb planted. This might be the opportunity he needed. That one was. E There's a pin now. This one's far from over. The inspirational always inspires. What a strike! I think things are about to get turned upside down. I think you are correct. Shot block. This might be it. Oh my! Beautiful technique. What is it that Bo Dallas is looking to do to change his look at this point? I don't think this is how he envisioned this match going here tonight. Oh man, incredible impact! He's looking banged up here, guys. And it looks like things are about to get even worse. Ooh! Get in there, ref. He's got him here. He's got him up. Sidewalk slam. Almost drove him through the ring. Over time, there have been various types of six-man teams that have been successful. There are family trios like the Guerreros, the Grams, the Andersons, and the Von Erichs. There have been members of factions who have also produced tremendous six-man teams like the Fabulous Freebirds, the Four Horsemen, the NWO, and D-Generation X. Byron, you mentioned some families and groups that created incredible six-man teams. Talking more about factions. Don't forget about the likes of the Hart Foundation, Evolution, the Wyatt Family, the Shield, and the New Day. These are only some of the trios who had unbelievable matches against a variety of adversaries. If we're talking about three-man teams, I need to shout out one of the baddest trios of all time who held the World Six-Man Championship on a number of occasions. I'm talking about the American Dream Dusty Rhodes and the Road Warriors. When the Dream put on the face paint, you knew it was going to be a bad night. Bo Dallas setting him up. Perched across the top rope. Whiplash deck breaker. Talk about taking care of business. Big time atomic drop. I don't have you walking funny. The cover. And he breaks the pin. 
just a debilitating neck breaker. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, my goodness. Crushing it. Byron, you talked about the moment in six-man tag matches when all semblance of order break. Oh, and he makes the tag. That was a game changer right there, Michael. Oh, and he reverses it. Oh, boy, he is good. No luck against Batista there. The Miz was able to get out of the way there. Wow, an A-list knee strike by the Miz. Beautiful technique. There have been plenty of WWE stars who had their first exposure on... Oh, oh Buster by the animal. And he doesn't stay down for long. Too soon. And here comes Batista. Thunderous slam. This is his opportunity to win this thing. And he goes for the pin! I brought up Miz's tough enough beginnings before, but I must commend him as a judge on tough enough in 2015. In his first episode as a judge, he saved Mandy Rose from elimination. Who would eliminate Mandy Rose? Uh, even though he was called a judge on that show, the Miz had a lot of wisdom to impart to that season's talent. Few folks know what it's like to grow from reality star to WWE. Looking for the exclamation point. That's not going to do it. Not yet. DDT. What's he going to do now? Talk about getting knocked into the middle of next week. Thanks to Raw General Manager Kurt Angle in May of 2017, the WWE Universe saw a dream team come together when the Hardy Boys joined forces with the Lunatic Dream Team Ambrose. The exciting trio took a watch it from out of nowhere. I think this is the beginning of the end, Michael. No, kicks out in time. He can withstand a lot more punishment, I can promise you that. Byron, we always make a point to talk about continuity amongst team members. In the six-man match, with Dean Ambrose team with the Hardys against Sheamus, Cesaro, and the Miz, both teams worked very well together. That surprised me, since this was the first time they teamed together. And if he hits the... Nine. Butter! That should do it. Irish whip! Wicked clothesline! Oh, nasty impact. Oh, thought he had nothing left. In 2016, the New Day found themselves in the middle of a sick and twisted rivalry with the Wyatt family. Things escalated to the point where Bray Wyatt invited the New Day to do battle at the Wyatt family compound. New Day accepted, but what followed was something no one expected or will ever be able to forget. And he got a near fall out of it. The Viper just will not die here tonight. Corey, you talked about six-man tag matches, and earlier you talked about one that caught the attention of the entire sports entertainment world. The New Day fought for survival amongst the darkness of the Wyatt family compound in a battle where pickaxes and cinder blocks were used as weapons and automobiles were used as... And this is gonna be it! This might be it! Oh my! True testament to grit. How'd he do that? What a stomp! Good grief! takes a ton of strength to pull off, am I right? Oh, you are definitely right, Michael. But you also have to remember how much energy it rains to pull off. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Oh, no. And our KO! This one's over, guys. Here we go for the win! Oh, schoolboy! Oh, go for it! Kick it out as Curtis Axel. Nah, not yet. Too early. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. Oh, oh, oh man! Bad news for Bo Dallas. Oh, boy, he is rolling. What a strike. Right on the mark. Nailed it. Full oh, what impact. Randy Orton is one of the most dominant competitors in WWE history. With few He's looking at him. That was the boat dazzler. That has got to be it. Oh, oh my God. Shoulder breaker. That could cause long-term damage. Oh my goodness. Crushing it. Uh-oh. On 
him out to dry. Good night. Now it's time to capitalize. Corey brought up Orton's many shoulder injuries earlier. My quick racer got the shoulders down. Next handle finds the mark. Randy Orton looking in this. We've seen this. To think, I own. He's going for the pin. Ooh, what impact! What is the Miz after? He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Oh boy, he is rolling. When a superstar is in a six-man match, one of the and he tags his partner in. Momentum has certainly shifted here, Michael. Caught him with a big boot on the mark. Oh. Massive atomic drop. That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guys. Harsh impact. Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. When this guy's on, look out. Triple H makes the tag. The biggest thing an opponent has to be aware of when they lock up with Bo Dallas is falling under an immediate attack. The Bo leave in Bo spirit has consumed Bo Dallas, and this man is more ferocious than ever. Oh, he slammed his face right into the barricade. Oh! Six of WWE's most alpha personalities all competing in the same match. There's a good chance this one ends deteriorating sooner than later. Ooh, what impact. The Bo Dallas we see now is much different than the individual who debuted in WWE in 2014. For someone challenging Bo Dallas today, they need to be ready to square off against a vicious individual. What Bo Dallas has shown us is that he's willing to take out anyone at any time. An opponent must be ready for anything once they've been identified as Dallas' opponent. I mean, before they even get in the ring. That'll hurt. DDT! Oh, nasty impact. Nailed it. Instances when a six-man tag match will feature a team where superstars have... Uh-oh. End this! He's in control now! He goes for the cover. He gets the shoulder up in time. The King of Kings won't be dethroned just yet. Yeah, too much experience. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Down! Like being manhandled by a bear. He's looking good now, guys. There's not a person in this arena who thought that was it for him. Oh, man, I don't know who to root for. Corey, earlier you talked about what needs to happen when members of a six-man team have differences or had differences in the past. If the team can't find a way to get on the same page, they will not last very long. Someone on the team has to step up and make sure for at least that match, everyone on the team can work together. Well, that's easier said than done. Just because superstars might be favorites of the WWE Universe or have a common enemy, that doesn't mean they'll get along. It also doesn't mean that any past issues will magically go away. In this business, people have long memories, so if someone sees an issue on their team, they need to resolve it right away. Something that is always important in a six-man match is having the ability to perform double-team moves. One of the things that successful six-man teams try and execute our double team moves and then have the third team member perform a signature or finishing maneuver to deliver maximum impact to an opponent. What a stomp! Good grief! This might be it! Oh my! DDT! Fight them! Big slam! Beautiful technique! <laughs> oh man! He wants no part of the outside! Cobra clutch! Got it cinched in! Fading fast! And there's the tag, the Miz into the ring. Close line! Down he goes. That'll do it every time. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Triple H. Oof! Takes him down in a major way, too. Big 
Sheamus might want to rethink this show, but you got to believe this one's over. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Wow, I thought he was a god. Yeah, but it's all about sustaining that effort. Let's hope he can do it. Whoa, Triple H dodged that one. Can he end it? Will he be victorious? And there's the breakup. Just in the nick of time. What an aggressive side slam. What a stop. Good grief. Uh-oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Pedigree. The Miz getting out, going for the cover. And the instinct from Bo Dallas on display. Jumping, leaping attack. Harsh impact. <laughs> Neck breaker. Ouch. Both teams working well here together. That's not always the case in a six man tag team match. Oftentimes, you'll see personal agendas eat their way into the action. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Pedigree. It's just not Bo Dallas's night, guys. That'll likely do it, Michael. Can he do it here? Broken up, and the match continues. Ah, backdrop suplex. Given what we've seen so far here tonight, it's hard to believe, but one of these teams will walk away from this match with their heads hung. You've got a boatload of energy. See the pedigree. This one is over. Oh, man, both down. He could do it here. Both Dallas has been eliminated. With the tag is Batista. Batista showing the WWE Universe his rage and emotion. If I was Triple H, I'd tone down the showboating a little bit. What a strike! Oh, what impact! Oh, man! Backbreaker! match so far guys but it looks to me like we're possibly nearing the end here axe handle finds its target what a stop Good grief. Regardless of how this one ends, all six of these superstars should be proud of this effort here tonight. Batista Bomb! But can he follow up here? He thinks he has it! Two! quite a show. Here's another look. He's getting after it here. Man, this was great. Look at him go. Ain't nothing better than action like this.
didn't happen. 